How will the Springfielder of the future get around town? Will he be like Bus Stop Bill, caught out in the rain? Is there no way to get to work in comfort, safety, and style? Well, it looks like Motor Car Mel's got the answer. All that's left is to pick Junior up from school. Well, that concludes... I don't really know what that was. Now, please take out your homework. Homework? What homework? Mine features indigenous Hopi songs. The good news is, over a hundred years later, a brilliant little boy receives an A for his amazing presentation. Ah! I can build one of those things from the crap in my desk. Bart Simpson, you've had three months to do this project. You started 30 seconds ago. Thank you. Thank you. I'm not complimenting you. Bart, I'm sending your parents a letter. Irresponsible. Unprepared. Bad seed. Good guy. Bad guy. Signed, stamped, and sealed. Outgoing mail slot now. Gotta stop that letter. Sixth graders? No! I'm sure it's a training drive. PG 13. They have an unwanted boner. Mom, I have a fever. One hundred and three? No school today. I gotta get that letter before Mom and Dad do. Stay focused. No! <gasps> Credit card offer overdue bill. Credit card offer overdue bill. Huh? What's this? These are Bart's uncompleted homework assignments for the last month. That's a heavy workload for a fourth grader. I say this boy needs more homework. I don't have to do it with him, do I? No. Pile it on. I want him to be Korean by the time he's done. Oh, thanks for doing the dishes. No problem. You can unload. You know, I think Bart might have too much homework. If they keep overwhelming him, he might be turned off school forever. Digibot, Go Go Goman has the crystal light bulb. Hey, you're supposed to be doing your homework. No more TV for you. It's okay, Bart. Just do a couple vocabulary words and come have some milk and cookies. Mom and Dad just told me two different things. Well, sometimes people who agree on most things have one issue that they disagree strongly about. Can I play them against each other so I don't have to do any homework at all? So much homework. Childhood slipping away. <clears throat> Bart, put down those books and go play this instant. If you say so. Dear Lord, please give my stubborn husband the wisdom to see that I am right as usual. Too late, Marge. I already used the prayer block on your prayer. Why aren't you doing your homework? I said he could take a break. The violence really relaxes me. You don't get to relax till you get to the bottom of this homework stack. Let's have lunch at Crouching Tiger Hidden Egg Roll. Smooth move, Mom, tricking Dad into having lunch at the one place that doesn't serve beer. What's the... Fine, I was going to apologize, but now I'm not going you to. You are never going to apologize. I was too. The words were in my brain. You're wrong. And whenever you're wrong, you just spout gibberish. Well, I'm going to tell you what I mean. You know what I... I don't mind if you pee in the shower, but only if you're taking a shower. No freedom. I have no freedom around this house. After sex, I'm not talking to you. Well, then there won't be any sex. Gotta stay mad. The next morning is where the fight is won or lost. Freeze him out. It's cold in Marge's doghouse, baby. Must win fight. I'm pretty sure this is not a dream. <gasps> oh my god, I killed her! <laughs> well, I've got to apologize. I just think when two people disagree, the big jerk ought to apologize. You know, Marge... 
Maud and I had a fight right before she died. I played that fight over in my mind a thousand times a day. Compromise has no place in a marriage. Stick to your guns. And if he leaves, you'll be free and happy like us. I'm going to find my husband. Don't depress the kids. <laughs> Put down some flares, boys. We're gonna be here a while. Dad, I know you're gonna say no, but Mom would say... Whatever, knock yourself out. What do you mean? You may not realize this part, but your mother and I have been fighting about you a lot lately. And I've realized our marriage is more important than your future. From now on, you're on your own. Really? Okay. Ah, peaceful Saturday afternoon with no Bart Simpson. And no Millhouse, for that matter. Nothing on my agenda but to sit here and watch hummingbirds. <laughs> Big mistake. Attacking me outside school hours and property. Legally, I can spank your bare bottoms. Follow me! What is this place? Remember that time I was carried off by groundhogs? This is where I wound up. Behold, an ancient subway station. <laughs> I love watching you knit. It reminds me of watching pictures download on our old dial-up modem. Remember that day we brought it home and it was all... <gasps> Oh, you won't believe how I got home. Don't know, don't care. You don't even want to know if I have anything to do with this mysterious seismic activity of late? Nope. I'm saving my yelling for where it does some good. It's weird. I just made an entire town lose its lunch. And? And I'm not feeling the rush. Bart, at the end of the day, if your parents aren't PO'd, you haven't really pranked. You gotta take it up a notch. Really? If no one's getting mad, are you really being bad? One more shake, and the whole school could come down. Seymour, do something. Mom and Dad, Bart is going to use the old subway to destroy Springfield Elementary. And there's a map of the subway system attached. Homer, we've got to stop him. Oh, she's coming down. Oh, Lord, let me finish this hallway. Then you can send me to hell, a happy man. Destroy! Destroy! Oh, but look at that ironwork. Hello, B, there's a sofa in here. <laughs> Mister, you are grounded. And no TV. And I'm taking all the exciting colors out of your crayon. Oh, you guys are the meanest parents ever. Thank you. Life stinks, huh? Totally. Mom said she was tipped off by a note from me. But you know something? I didn't write this note. Elementary, my dear Simpson. Leave it to you to misspell a word you see first thing every morning. But don't worry. Your secret's safe with me. Thanks, Lise. Don't!